Hey everybody, Outdoor Jack here, and today it's my lunch break, and what better way to have a little fun on your lunch break than to shoot a few rounds down range. Today I am shooting this Bagara B14 Wilderness Terrain Rifle in 6.5 Creedmoor, but what I'm gonna be doing today is going through what I like about this new Graybo stock. It looks sweet. It is the Eagle in this special finish here. So let's go ahead and load up a few rounds, shoot this a couple times, then we'll come back and we will talk about all the different features that I like about this stock from Graybo. Well, that was a lot of fun. I love shooting the 6.5 Creedmoor round. It is an awesome caliber. And match that caliber with this rifle and this stock, and it is just a pleasure to shoot in a great mountain or just overall wilderness rifle. So let's go into all of these different features that make this Eagle stock just an awesome one and a great rifle stock for anybody that's looking to upgrade or add a few more features to their rifle. So the first feature that we're gonna look at is the length of pull. The length of pull on this Eagle stock is 12.75 inches to 14 inches. So it's adjustable by taking out these shims at the back of the stock and you just make that rifle so much more customized to you. Another thing on this side of the gun is, as you can see here, the butt pad. This is a great recoil reducing butt pad. It's really cushiony and it just absorbs a lot of the shock from those heavy calibers or even the smaller calibers and just makes it even better to shoot. Next, moving up the rifle and up the stock, we have the grip here. We've got a 60 degree angle here. It's an M4 style grip. It really feels well. It's a nice uh, palm swell and basically just lets you bear down on that rifle and have a light touch, but still control the rifle how you need to for every shot. Sticking with the back side of the rifle, we have just a basic um, cheek comb here. Also, back here on the back part, you've got a cut out um, area to reduce some of that weight because this stock comes in at just 33 ounces. I think the original stock on this rifle from Bagara was right at like 56 ounces. So you're reducing over a pound of weight that you'd be carrying going to a Graybo Eagle stock. All right, moving up the stock from the grip to the action, this Eagle fits any Remington 700 clone. All you have to do is go to the Graybo.com website, go to the Eagle page, select from the drop down your rifle, and when you are sent your stock, it'll be customized perfectly to fit your rifle that you have at home. So we've talked about the action and how you can get it for just about every rifle that is out there that's a Remington 700 clone. Well, the next thing here is the barrel channel. It's a universal barrel channel that will fit just about everything all the way up to a proof research barrel. So this inlet is going to fit it. But if you have a question that your barrel is just bigger than normal or bigger than a proof research style barrel, definitely give the guys at Graybo a, a call so that you can make sure that you get the stock that's going to fit your rifle. So last but not least on this rifle, there are two sling mounts on the forend, one, two, and then one sling mount on the butt stock. And if you like this finish, this is the Hunter Orange version, but there are over 25, 26 different color options and variations for this rifle stock. This is the Eagle from Graybow. If you want to learn more, go online to graybow.com.